Here's the story of a lovely black, 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 black and black. I'm bald headed. I don't know where my wig is. I got one lash. <laughs> <laughs> what happened now? Y'all hear this second child BS? What ha happened was, you what? know. Oh. We're talking about uh, baby books that uh, mine did not get filled out for, you Here's know. to your baby book. What I'm, baby book? I'm gonna fill it you out. You mean my name book? Go figure. What had happened was... Yeah, 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 what had happened was... Thank you, Kevin. Ah, yes, what had happened was... If you're new to this channel, my name is Douglas. I am the companion of the person who runs this channel. And I'm going to explain what what had happened was means. It's a phrase used by darker individuals when they don't really have a good excuse, but they're going to explain one to you anyways. You know what, the first one, y'all happy-go-lucky, and then you put all the names and all the pictures in the christening gown and all that. By the time the second one comes, well, hell, I get around to it. I put your name in the book, though. Y yeah! Yeah, that's about it. That's all you did, uh, y'all. Oh, yeah, I was gonna finish that. Were you? I still got time. Because I'm grown now. I still got the baby pictures. Oh, you a hot mess. <laughs> Second children, comment down below if you even have. Okay, then just get the damn book so I can figure it out. Fill it out so we can get this over. You don't remember nothing. Don't remember a dang thing. You had me out there with overalls, no sir. I remember you had five heads. Oh! <laughs> You wanna die? You yeah, you had You had a five hit. That was distinctive. It Yo, was like, boom. Be quiet. I, I my said name. I was gonna fill it out, didn't I? My name card. <laughs> Go get that damn book before you get on my nerves. <laughs> oh my god, their whole place is so adorable. Hi, babe. She came out too. <laughs> Yay, young folks time. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The rest of the family's coming. All right, so we filled out a little form and then the second step was to put our stuff in these little bags. And now we get to pick a kimono. They had a bunch of different options. I'm just gonna go with the Hana one, which is like flower pattern. There was a lot. I like the retro one, but I can't pull it off. I think you can pull that retro branding one off. Oh, the ones on here. That might be it. They're more expensive, but they had more simple, like oh, sophisticated patterns. I'm just gonna go for the clowny patterns. You know what I'm that's not a good word. The vivid, the vivid patterns and they're cheap. This is so pretty. I want like flowers. <gasps> These are so pretty. I love how you can just pick. Okay. Our, uh, I wonder if women take like way too long with this and they're like, look girl, you got five minutes. Second stage, all wrapped up. All right, next Hi. stage. Wow. I actually feel very comfortable. Oh, only a little. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't want hair, but I want hair accessories, so I might have to recircle that. Okay, just finished everything, and the next part is picking your OB, which is the belt. I can hear Cornelia and my mom in here talking about me. Yeah, she has me with my hair. Oh, I heard y'all in here chit-chatting. Yes. You're just so You're nice. You're so pretty. That's pretty. I would have picked something like that. Kristen did. I like that one you have though. I don't think that one's there. Yeah, they're all kind of different. I like that. Mm-hmm. It's fine. <gasps> Listen to her. Did she say that? I'll grab it from you. Gonna do it for me? Okay, thank you. <laughs> Let me get it from Sunday talks about me with my big thumb in it. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like I asked her to hold the camera and take photos of us. All of them had her big red fingernail in all oh, of the shots. No. So I was like, oh, okay, that's nice. <laughs> yeah. Nice addition. I was like, what's that red thing? It's so funny. I actually hate red. I was like, why did I pick this? Really? It's well, cute, it looks cute. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Even just if, drawn to it. Right? Something, it just pulls you. Uh, you would understand. I would. You're so nice. I thought I was going to be like super duper tight. I'm very 
comfortable. It falls very nicely. I hope mine falls the same. Oh my god. Did you get the pink one that you like? Uh, yeah, oh, but uh, we'll see how it goes. I'm surprised you've never dressed up in one before. I know. I, I just you do stuff. Like you actually go out and do the stuff. <laughs> I know. I think it's just yeah, summertime Yucata because it's always cold and I'm never in Kyoto. I think I want to go to Kyoto and wear one as well. Uh -huh. So I was waiting for that and then you said you were going. I was like, nah, forget it. <laughs> Girl, yes, it's lovely. Final touches. They're putting some accessories on the obi and a piece of lace. So I picked white and it's kind of like a gold. And Teddy's dressed first. The hair just works because you got a long neck too. That is so cute. Adorable. You literally look like you were just made to be in this thing. Okay, this is overwhelming. So they can arrange your hair and you can pick accessories as well. I want something sparkly. 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 Oh, I'm so bad at this. I'm not very girly. Can we get a real girl in here? Oh. Oh, I also saw me one on this color. <laughs> Ooh, that's pretty. I like this one. This one. Ooh! Oh, okay. Uh, something in the corner. Cut it. Let it get this one. Yeah. I regret not bringing gel. I told her it's a wig. Be careful. It's gonna move. I was really surprised that they did black hair so well. They did my sister's hair and Cornelia's natural hair, and it looks amazing. I was like, okay, never mind. I originally put no hair, and now I'm like, nope, just mind. Please do my hair too. That's pretty. I thought it was a little plain, so I'm getting a flower as well. Nice. Jackie, that's so pretty. You like it? Pretty. Yay. <gasps> oh, yeah. It's better rather because I'm awesome. <laughs> wow, that's so pretty. Yay. I can confirm. Hairstyling is black girl friendly. Like, she understood. She understood this was a wig. She did Cornelia's hair, which is natural. She did my sister's hair. She has a yakky wig on. And they did a great job. They did an up style, even though it's a wig. Looks so good. Okay, the fun continues. She's like, choose a bag. Any of these? Anyone. So I'm not bringing my backpack. All I want to know is what can my camera fit in? Okay, this is actually more overwhelming. So many choices. This is not the place for people who are indecisive. Okay. okay. Think of your sister. Okay. Can my camera fit in here? So they have a garden service. Their setup is so cute. Well done. It's so funny because literally I don't like red. I don't like red or blue. And somehow I chose red. I, I don't know, just calling me. It's giving Inuyasha. I think that's why. I was like, ooh. It feels familiar, even though it's not the same spider lily flowers that are usually in it. It just gave me the vibe. I don't know. Anyways, that was super easy. Very fun. Everyone was so nice. And there's a lot of options. Like, if you're somebody who's very indecisive, I'd say make sure you come early or just prepare yourself mentally because there's a lot of choices. Like, the accessory for the belt, the lace for the belt, the kimono, of course, the, the hairstyle, which pins you want. Oh my god, it's a lot. So, prepare yourself. Also, if you want to just dress up and take photos here, they have a really beautiful garden. It's so nice. Which I don't want to, but my mom wants to. We're done! Everybody's dressed. I feel like the biggest warning we need to give is these shoe sizes. Girl. Right? Look at these. Okay. <laughs> the yeah. heel is hanging. Wait, what size are you? Eight. Oh, I thought it was eight and a half. No. Oh, thank Nine. you. Okay, yeah, so if you're eight, you go bring your own shoes. I'm like a 10. Oh, <gasps> you're 10? I think no so. No wonder. Yeah, Look <laughs> Alright, so basically, the reason why I've never worn a kimono is because I actually don't agree with this whole thing, to be honest. It's... I don't know what to say. People are going to be mad at me. Is that the culture appropriation? There's just no reason. Like, Yukata, there's a reason. It's the firework festival, or you're going to the beach, or you're going to the hotel, or you're going to the onsen. There's a reason. Kimono, there's no reason. Unless you're getting married, or you're graduating, or you're doing a tea ceremony. Otherwise, you're literally just dressing up in someone else's culture. So yeah, I never, never did it. That was everything. My mama handed me this. I said, can you open it? Oh, Courtney was like, what is that again? <laughs> oh, wow. She was like, oh, it's one of those things. One of those things? One of them old folks things. <laughs> she didn't say it. I can't get it out. Yeah, not the ratchet nails going across my screens. <laughs> beef croquette with cheese inside. It's very good. After our Kamakura beers, I like the green one. You have green, red, and blue, and the one with the face on it, but I like this one the most. And then after that, I'm gonna take Teddy into this line so we can get fish cakes. Actually, let's get in the line now. You get in the fish cake line, you vegan. <laughs> 
so many flavors, but I would definitely recommend the potato with butter and octopus. And if they have shrimp, they have shrimp at different ones, but I don't see the shrimp on this list. But the shrimp one is very good as well. So this area is famous for shirasu, or white bait, which is these little fishes. You'll see them everywhere. See, they're steamed fish cakes, which my camera cannot see that well. All right, I made mom get the beef croquette. It has cheese in the middle. It's very heavy, so I was just like, get one and share. All right, y'all go ahead and try when you're ready. Okay. Wanna take the first bite? Okay. She said, no, it's <laughs> You heard that? No. You what happened? Me. She said, wanna take the first bite? Jackie was like, nope. nope. <laughs> I love Jackie. Wow, Jackie. It's quite... I've never tried it, actually. Everyone just said it was better. Mm -hmm. How is it, Mom? It's good. Where's the cheese? I don't see any cheese. Did you get the wrong one? I don't know. Uh, I don't get the good one. Okay, octopus. The cheese is sold out. We could have sat down. Oh, we can't really go anywhere. You got to eat where you buy. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. Well, this one's popular. This is most popular. Number one, number two, number three. Ooh, okay. Number two, it looks like, oh my god, that's Rimaru. Rimaru. I'm trying to convince them all to buy jelly soaps. They're so cool. It's like nothing like the texture you would think of soap. And they smell really good. I like the lavender one. I always bring this home. It's like a honey drink. Next stop, apple pie. I don't know how to say that. Is it Mili Mili? It's delicious. All right, here we go. They claim to have the best apple pie in the world. The whole world, not just Kamakura, not Japan, the world. Kristen, how many apple pies have you had in your life? A lot this week. Just this week, a lot. Yeah. Is this the best one? Yeah. Uh-oh, she didn't just you know, The crust looks oh very god. flaky. She said, oh my god, you yeah, shut up, you ain't even eating it. Why are you narrating? I can see. <laughs> it's very good. Have you even gotten to the apple yet? That's cream in it too, huh? Maybe I'll get my own. It's custard. It might be it's custard. Like yeah, it's yeah, delicious. Yeah. You should get your own. <laughs> Did you hear? You should get your own. Ooh, that looks you amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. I didn't put it all the way in my mouth. Mm. <laughs> oh my god. That is so good. Oh my god. Oh, right, she's sold. Give me a bite. Well, dang. I love how he feels welcome here. We it's like animals in here. God. I feel like all we've been doing is lining up for food. Yes. That's <laughs> what we do. That's what we do. <laughs> all right. I don't really like curry, but my mom and Teddy got one. It's curry and cheese. How was it? Okay, so just took a bite into the bread. Mm -hmm. Very thick bread. I love the crumb crust. It gives oh. it a lot of texture. Oh, yeah. I haven't gotten into the metal part yet, but here we go. Get into it. I feel like we need a cooking show, an eating show, not just eating. Definitely giving curry. Giving curry. It's good. Really hot too. It's good. Is that the one with the cheese in it? Yep, there you go. I was waiting for you. Over here got me in the sun. Bite into that. Tell me what you think. Those things are overpriced. Ben and a snap. You did, did you get to the curry? No. Oh, it's good. Is it worth that line that everybody over here hovering for? Because I've I never like tried it. I don't like curry, so I couldn't pick. I see people dragging out cheese like that. Because you didn't get into it yet. Okay. I've been waiting for a cheese pool. How long do I have to wait for a cheese pool? How many bites do you get to the cheese pool? Get a bite. Can't get the cheese. I just don't like curry. Unless it's that one chop down the road. It's good though. Oh, we got a cheese bowl. There we go. We got some cheese bowl. That's what I'm talking. Mukbang that mug. <laughs> not ending. Oh, you still going? You gotta pull it. Yeah, pull. There you go. Yeah, mom. That's the mukbang. Said he's still a fail. I'm gonna need you to win one time. Look now. I'm gonna need you to stop. Damn, that was going forever. <laughs> Oh, she got her cheese. Okay, Teddy. Oh, Jackie got it on her first try. <laughs> okay, Teddy, I see you. Y'all got it. Officially out of money. And Jackie has her money in stuff. <laughs> so she's got to beg and plead for mercy. No worries. Have mercy on me. It's like a soup dumpling. So imagine gyoza with soup inside of it, like all inside of this bowl, and then you put it in your mouth. I tried to tell my best friend what it, what it was, and I just realized what I said. It's meat that busts in your mouth. I was like, I gotta think of another way to explain this. Okay, well, how would you explain 
explain it. Okay, it's meat in a dumpling that busts in your mouth. Well, I guess the shrimp ones are green. Here we go. I'll take the small one. I feel like this is when my kimono is going to meet its end. Oh, it's hot. Is it hot? Woo! Not hot enough to burn you, but it's hot. But if you bite it, like just do the top and then suck it out because it's going to be everywhere. Oh, see what I saw? Mom, bite the top, suck it. Right, I'm yeah. done. Yeah. I'm done explaining this food. <laughs> Okay, Teddy's ground one on the floor. Oh my god, it's kind of good though. It's so good. That's my flavor. It does leak out though. Maybe do it over. She's struggling. No, I just want the broth. Yeah, it's so good. I'm just trying to catch a we decided to do a rickshaw. It's so funny because like I see them all around the neighborhood and yeah. I'm just like, yeah, that'd be so nice. They're very expensive over here though. So for all six of us, five hundred dollars, almost four hundred dollars. It's fun though. If you, can, if you can do it, do it. We did an Asakusa once, me and my sister. Now it's part two. Want to get in? Safety first. Yeah. Okay. 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 Let's go. Okay. You must be so strong. I know. Yeah. So, I'm Kotaro. Kotaro. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay. Let's go. His okay. name is Kipe. Kotaro. 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 Kipe. 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 Natsuru. 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 I've never heard Natsuru, Natsuru in my life. Oh, yeah. Oh. Help me, it's a little heavy. These girls are a little thick. They got some thighs. I don't know if I can do this by myself. Oh my gosh. Right when he lifted up, he was like, I regret this. <laughs> I feel like the biggest tourist ever. I low key want to wear a mask. No! You must show them that people do this stuff too. So true. So true. It's really cool, and it's a great way as soon as you get tired. I love how the street up to the shrine is just lined with the cherry blossoms. In the middle, so you don't have to fight with the sidewalk or traffic. It's like an exclusive walkway. Beautiful. I love these traditional little shops. I appreciate your help, truly. Really. Oh, no, no worries. My first one. Hey! How adorable! I haven't been down this back tree. It's gonna take me to some new places. Yeah. yeah. Yes! The weather is kind of perfect. It is. Oh, yeah. Ah, I see. All right, what's your favorite cherry blossom spot? For the park, Shinjuku Gyon. I, oh my god, same! Yeah? Nice. Because, yeah, it's just gorgeous, perfect, spicy. And you can touch them, is my thing. Oh, well, you're, not really, you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to. That's not what I meant. That's not what I meant. You can get extremely close. close. Yeah. So, like, if I want to, I can have branches like behind me, like going, you know? Or one whacking in the face. That's yeah, what I Yeah, like. exactly. Yeah, <laughs> whacking you in the <laughs> face. Yeah, and recently I went to Sakura Kawasaka. It's like a special area, like where they first. Where is that? In... Oh, is it in February? Yeah, the in February Izu. one. Oh, yeah, it's the same spot. We went to the same spot. Did they? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, did, uh, you, did you go? When did you go? That spot last year. Oh. For my tuna rice ball hoodie that I moved globally. <gasps> that's where you were. For yeah. It. Oh, I love that spot. Oh, my God. That spot is so great. So pretty. Yeah. I quite enjoy Back. Okay, that tree is every. Oh, they're lucky. Whoever lives here is so lucky. Yeah. Upstairs? Yeah. No, five stones. It's like 180 centimeter. Like, oh, it's so like here. Yeah. Really? Like, My head is. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. <laughs> they're so beautiful. Cherry blossom. Yes. Let's take great. pictures. Okay. This is so peaceful. Oh, it's down there. Wow. 
and I feel like I'm learning like new spots that I didn't even know existed. She just jumped out of this dang thing in the kimono. Did you just jump out? Yeah, I did. I jumped. Yeah, jump, jump, jump. They never take it. They're not gonna take it. I'll put it in there. All right, we just got done with the rickshaws. That was actually so much fun. And they took me to places that I didn't even know existed in this town. I can't wait. I found another shrine around the corner that he took us by. I have got to go back there. I'm very excited. All right, but now we're at the main shrine, the one that everyone comes to. We're gonna walk around here for a little while. And then actually, I don't know what's after that. After that, it's all up in the air. You know, what we feel like doing. I'm ready to breathe though. No, it's not as tight as you think, but if you eat a lot, or don't get gas, don't get gas in this thing. Probably looks very familiar, been here so many times. <laughs> oh, Teddy. It's the gang. Gang, gang. Y'all don't know how aggressive these fish is. Oh, they disrespect us. Because they be punking people for their food, beating up birds and stuff. Okay, just know this is hard. This is harder than crip walking. We gotta give it up to these kimono ladies. This ain't a joke. I just lost it. There's a new cafe and it looks absolutely amazing. So this area, they were like always blocked off or doing construction. I've been wondering what was behind this gate for so long. <gasps> There's a big old pond back here. Oh my gosh. Okay, I just found my new everyday spot. I am so happy. Wow. That is so beautiful. What a beautiful cafe. All right, I think we should take some family photos over here. Some thuggy, uh, thuggy kimono shots. Like, I know I can't even do like, yeah, we need thuggy kimono shots. Oh, that actually looks a little, yeah, yeah that works. Yeah, it's really like, mm. I'm trying to think of how I can even drop it low in this thing. Maybe I can't. Hey. <laughs> of the day. I'm gonna take a photo of them at the bottom of the stairs. We're actually not gonna go up today. My mama's knee said no, so we're gonna be down here. Next stop, we're gonna go to the Big Buddha. It's so funny because when my best friend came to visit me the last time, that was the number one thing that she wanted to do. We ran all the way over here, and then by the time we got here, it was closed. And now we're like still like kind of on the brink, like it might be closed by the time we get there, so we'll see. So beautiful. Not that good. Van, thanks, sir. Oh, my hair is jacked. Girl. We made it inside. It's actually really beautiful. Cherry blossom tree is just giving this thing everything. And the weather's so perfect. Oh, it looks so small in here. <laughs> There's the get out song. Get out song. Made it just in time. This place closes at five, but last time that we came here, it was not even five and they were closed. So I don't really know what's going on. Anyways, it's only four minutes from my house. Four minutes. I need to come back. So we don't have much time. I just let them go explore and have fun and do what they want to do. It is so beautiful during spring though. The last time I came here, it was raining. The other time I came here, it was closed. So I couldn't really see. We we're just like peeking over the fence. Felt so bad for my best friend. It was the funniest picture we had of her entire trip. Depressing. So she finally made it, but now it's closing, so she doesn't have much time. I was really, really, really shocked with all of the responses we got in these day kimonos. So many Japanese people were like stopping and giving us compliments and telling like, like really nice things. And I'm like, that is so odd because I thought it was gonna be like the opposite. Like, ugh, why are you wearing our stuff? Which is why I don't do it for just funsies. Like, I'll do it for a reason, but I won't do it for fun. That was just really, really sweet and shocking. And then, when we were, like, on our way back, like, so many people kept asking for photos. And I was like, oh, that's so nice. They were really sweet to us. That was really cool. But yeah, I'm gonna go find the family and enjoy this little spot. I was like, I wonder where they are. Not hard to find. A bunch of black people in kimonos. That was easy. So amazing. So this is a moss if you're in Kamakura and of course Enoshima. Since I don't actually want any photos, I think I'm just gonna stand around and help everyone else take photos of the family. It's always like the poor dad. The poor dad always gets left out and then he looked like an absent father. He was there, but I swear like if we didn't take a photo, I don't remember the place. I don't remember what happened. I don't remember the event. Was I there? Let me help these fathers. 
Oh, we are all no, done. No, no, no. I am actually so happy to be done. Ooh, that was long. I, I would recommend what? I'd recommend like a good three hours. More yeah. than that, you gonna start to die. My feet. We were these we were five hours. We was here all that. Yeah, seven hours. Se yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, because yeah. we got here at 10, but it took an hour. It took like, yeah, it took a good hour to get ready, an hour to get dressed. So I'd say six five, hours. Six hours. five, six hours. I'd recommend three. Nice white glasses. Oh, I think their wine is organic as well. To the end of kimonos. To surviving. To surviving kimonos. <laughs> to surviving kimonos. <laughs> <laughs> So it has fresh mushrooms because I did not know I liked. I don't remember if I filmed this, but this is the best salad ever. How do you like it, Jackie? Mm -hmm. Good? Mm -hmm. Five stars. Five stars? Yeah, I love this salad. You guys gotta try this called calamari too.